Hey guys, it's MacOS Guru Xer, and I'm here to show you how to make a magic memory stick. However, for this uh, tutorial, you will need, sadly, a Windows computer. So, find a way to get your hands on one, and what you'll need to do is you'll need to download two files. You'll need the 401.pbp, which is the Sony official firmware, and then you'll also need the PSP Grader application. So, you want to open up PSP Grader, and it will open up this box that says uh, 4.01 eBoot. What you want to do is load eBoot and lo load eBoot and locate your 401.pbp file and hit open. That will downgrade your PSP automatically for you so you can uh, upgrade. So you want to hit, uh, is you want to do for PSP cylinders you want to do left trigger or triangle. This is for um, when you insert your Pandora's battery, what trigger you want to uh, load up your Pandora's. So next you'll need to um, select what drive your PSP is in. In my case, it will be, we want to go to USB connection, and it will um, allow us to connect to our computer and that's just going to allow us to um, select the target to uh, install the uh, downgrader and all that stuff. So yeah, that's what you'll need for that. We'll go back to the computer and you want to connect a USB. Sorry guys, I'm not ahead of the game here. Alright, so that's set up. Now it should say, uh, alright, so now usually it's F drive. Uh, that's my memory stick. So then you'll do create Pandora's, uh, Pandora stick. However, I've already done mine. I have my magic memory card in right now, which means it will not work again because it already detects all the files and I am running 4.0. 4.01 eBoot official firmware. So that is going to make it a uh, magic memory stick. It's that simple. You just run this program for about, the process takes about five minutes maximum I would say. So here I'll show you. We'll open up this and uh, here is the magic memory stick. However, once you have your official, your custom firmware, which is going to be my next video, you will want to undo the, um, you'll want to completely delete all this and then format the memory stick again because it said that um, games from your uh, magic memory stick will be very laggy for some reason. We do not know why, but that's how it's going to be. So you'll just personally have to make ISO and CXMB files, which, you know what, deal with it. Um, so that's the magic memory stick. The second part you need to make, uh, custom firmware. So watch my other tutorial on how to make the Pandora's battery. And my next video will be how to make custom firmware, which combines the two together. And thank you for watching. Please subscribe.